<laughs> Crazy lady with no eyebrows. Gonna invite some people. Almost done. I wish I could invite people ahead of time. Can Facebook work that out for me, please? And thank you. Please and thank you. I think that's it. Hey Jenna, hey Angela, hey Francesca, hey Amanda, hey Allison. All right, you guys, so I look crazy, right? All my makeup's done except for that. <laughs> I look nutty, but that's okay because we're going to make it look good. And then I won't be able to get it off without makeup remover tonight. So exciting stuff. Um, let's see. Oh yeah, I can see it, Amanda. I'm sorry your lives aren't working. That stinks. So, all right, you guys, what you're gonna need, Wonder Brow, oh, Wonder Brow. I used the blonde, because it was the lightest color. And I don't think that I would do like a brunette color, so I used the blonde. I'm gonna use this little brush it's like a really thin itty bitty brush um, to put it on and then I'm going to use a spoolie and then I'm going to use this little kind of like spackly looking brush to clean it up so let's get started so what I usually do is I it comes with this like brush that you could never, I mean, if you put that on your face, it's just going to look like a hot mess. So what I usually do is just go in there and get like, like get a decent amount, right? And I'm going to put it right here just on any kind of like plastic surface or something. Stick it back in there. I usually don't need more than just that. So then I'll take this little tiny brush here and I'll just get some like a dab don't glob it on because the way that I put this on the only way that I feel like it looks natural is if you use only a little bit at a time hey Lisa so I'm using this tiny little brush with like a tiny little bit so it's not I you you don't want to glob it on so what I'll do well, let me move you closer to my mirror so you guys can <laughs> All right, so I think that'll work. So I'm going to start with like small strokes, hair strokes with just a little bit of product on it. And just kind of move it around as much as you can because I don't like, the more product you use, the cakier and paintier it looks. So I'm just going to just keep dabbing this little um, thing here and doing a little bit at a time. Hey Carly. So I'm just gonna kinda start doing like an outline. So I'm just dabbing it here. I'm gonna use as little as possible, a little bit application, a little bit application, a little bit, like just keep going back and forth. Like 
You only want to use a tiny bit at a time. Hey, Ashley. So I'm just taking the Wonder Brow like off of this tiny little, like anything like plastic or whatever, and just putting on a little bit at a time. And like on the outside is where I have the least amount of hair. So that's kind of where it takes longer to get it right because sometimes one layer isn't enough. You have to put a layer on and then kind of let it dry a little bit and then put a little more on, but we'll see how it goes. This stuff is like different every single time I use it, I swear. <laughs> hey Amanda, thank you. It's really, um, honestly, it stays on crazy like through my face washing it stays on hey Amy good talking to you earlier girl so just little bits at a time like I said otherwise it'll look like painty like cakey hey Mindy just a little bit at a time I know Mindy said she loves her uh, Wonder Brow. How do you apply it? Do you apply it like this with like a little brush? Hey, Amy. Oh, Amy, you know it. Bye. Why do you think my neck is red? It's always, I should put makeup on my neck from now on. <laughs> oh, so yeah, okay. So you use one like this, maybe? Like this, Mindy? Amy, you can get it on Amazon Prime. Like, isn't that crazy? And drink my wine, yup. Y'all are so fun. So I'm just taking it, I usually just like spackle it on this, on some like plastic surface and just use little bits as possible. And it's not important, I mean, it's important to get it, um, Mindy, you better order some more, girl. <laughs> get it on Prime. Um, what was I saying? I don't remember now. Oh, it's not important to get it perfect, perfect, but you want to get like a general idea, hey Brittany, um, of like where you want it, how far you want like the tail to come out. My eyebrows are different every single time I do them. And you know, you just hope and pray that see like that's not like a nice sharp end, but I'm okay with that because I'm going to fix it. So like this looks kind of cakey, right? So I'm not gonna leave it like that. But I am gonna let this outside part dry a little bit. But you wanna let it dry, just you wanna let it dry a little bit because if you if you use a spoolie on it afterwards, while it's still wet, it's just gonna fly off. You wanna let it dry just a little bit so it's gonna stick. So I'm gonna do the same thing on this side. Do you guys also have an, like, but look, but for real, look at the difference. Just even that, and I, I'm gonna do a, like more to it. Hey, Diana, we're doing Wonder Brow. We're trying to figure out the best way to do it. I think this is my method with like a little, put it on like a little um, surface, cause it comes like this, but I just take it off like this spackle it on a little got this little small this little small guy here and then take a little at a time because that's the way I found it looks the most natural Like I said, it, it's not unfixable. It's not that permanent that you can't fix it if you mess something up too. So that's the good news. Like if you put concealer over this, it's coming off. So, 
Hey Brittany, this is blonde. It's the um the lightest color you can get. I didn't think that brunette would really suit me. And I think that honestly it's still a little bit too dark for some blondes. I'm not like extra extra blonde. So hey Susanna. I'm doing Wonder Brow. Showing you guys how I put it on. So you, want, you just want to do it the same way you would normally do with um, like a brow pencil too. You just want to try to do like um, short hair like strokes. So your hair kind of, go, my, at least my hair kind of goes up like that right here. So just going to kind of follow that. Otherwise it'll look, it might end up looking kind of funny. Hey Chelsea. All right, so I'm gonna actually give this one a second and I'm gonna um, do the spoolie on this one because I'm sure it's dry. And um, just kinda, you see it makes it look a little fluffier. And I'm not being light-handed with it either. It's pretty, um, it's pretty on there. This stuff sticks, thanks Angela. Um, this stuff sticks really well to hair, more than just the skin. So you can still use it if you just have skin, but it definitely sticks better with hair. Like if you have um, a little bit of hair to stick to. But we'll fix this part in a little bit. I'm gonna finish this one over here. <clears throat> How do you guys um, fill your eyebrows in right now, like before Wonder Brow? Do you guys use a pencil or, or um, do you guys use um, powder? Because I've tried everything. And um, this one definitely stays on the best. But I feel like the quickest one is just a pencil, but you really have to do lots of strokes with a pencil too to make it look natural, like a lot of strokes. So this is my challenge brow. Let's see how we get it. Use eyebrow gel. So like, is it tinted, Amy? It's like a tinted gel. I know, but you've got, I feel like you've got excellent eyebrows as it is too, right? Hey Shirley. Benefit Gimme Brow, okay. It's good to know. I like Benefit a lot too. My mascara is from Benefit. It's pretty. Tinted, okay. Yeah, I like I like tinted brow. Um, I'm gonna actually let this dry for a bit because like I I went over that part that's kind of like oh the wax is that Anastasia um, the wax and the powder Diana. Hey Shirley. Um, hey Jennifer. So I'm gonna go back and fix this one a little bit while I'm waiting on the other one to kind of dry. Just gonna get like so like a little tiny cap and I'm just gonna like dab a tiny bit like I don't want a whole lot cuz I don't want it to cake but you can just kind of do an outline you love it Shirley do you love it hey Jennifer thank you it's um Stila I'll get the color for you in a minute So I'm just fixing it with some concealer here. 
so you can get like that nice sharp edge. It's pretty nice. Yeah, it's nice when you want your makeup to stay on all night, right, Shirley? Um, Jennifer, you can see it's like, you can you can almost barely see the Estila, because I use it all the time. It's called Bachi, B-A-C-I. Let's see if I can get it into, no. B-A-C-I. Bachi? I don't know. If that, is that the name of it? So, um, Shirley, how do you put it on? Do you use a little or brush, or do you actually use the brush that comes with it? Sure, Jennifer. It stays on forever. I put this on, like, four hours ago, and I think I, yeah, I, like, ate some chips, and <laughs> I've been drinking my wine. Like, nowhere on my glass, right? Oh, I see. I see you, Shirley. But you look great. Gray is the new blonde, I'm telling you, Shirley. Ask my husband. Oh, a stiff angle brush, yeah. I think the stiff one's easier, um... This isn't super stiff, but I just, I feel like when I put it on with any other brush than this tiny itty bitty one, it just pulls up too much product and I can't man it. Like it, it ends up not looking great, but I'm super glad that you guys can use that. So I feel like you can even, can you guys even like hear this? It, look how it's pulling my skin just from like. So it, it dries. Hey, Molly. So it like it dries to the point where it's like really on there. But like I said, it sticks better on hair. So if you've got a decent amount of hair and you just want a little bit of coverage, this is like perfect for you, especially since, um, did you guys see how I had like that little bald spot there and I just kept doing that and it kind of um, covered it? That's pretty cool. Um, sorry, I'm all over the place with my comp. <laughs> so this one's the finished one. I cleaned it up and everything. So I feel, I feel like it looks pretty like natural and good. I have to clean this one up a little bit and then we're good. I don't think that, I don't think that took too long. Before I used this, I was always using a pencil. And, um, but I have like a whole drawer of brow products because brows have been the hardest thing for me to figure out on and on, like for reals. So I'm just gonna take a little bit of concealer with this guy and just clean it up a little bit. Hey Mitchell. So that gives you like a nice line too. But I think one of the main keys is to make sure you spoolie after you use it because when you do, it gives your hair, um, <laughs> your eyebrows much more of like a real hair look rather than just kind of sticking to your face. Girl, Karim, um, how I learned. Well, I watched a lot of YouTube videos. Speaking of YouTube videos, all my lives are on YouTube now. So if you guys want to check those out, um, I'm, um, I'll post the link below. Um, but really honestly, it's just cause I like to do makeup. Um, 
And I obviously like my neck to be red. Must be the wine. Oh, do you guys see my wings? They're not bad, right? I mean, this one, I guess, could be a little bit straighter, but I feel like they're pretty banging. I will. I'll post the link, Cam. Um, I used my... I used my um, vamp stamp for these. <laughs> we'll, we'll get you an address, Karim. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, so I used my vamp stamp for this. So, oh wait, this is the right side. So like this piece right here, I just use it this way and like, and it does make a huge difference what kind of eyeliner you use to paint on there. Actually, when I think you, when you buy it, it actually comes with like a little sponge it's kind of like a little pot like this with a sponge in it like obviously you open it and dip it um so I had to order this on Nordstrom's or you order it directly from the company so I just ordered on Nordstrom's um and it was sent directly to me um but I didn't order the um the the eyeliner the actual eyeliner that came with it um Honestly, I've been practicing with it, Karen, and I feel like, uh, you know, I tried two different eyeliners when I, when I put it on the stamp. I tried this one, and then I tried, I think it was this, like this one. So the one I, the one I think is best is the L'Oreal Telescopic, because it's really, really, really black. It's like super dark, and when you, when you do your little stamp, even if it doesn't stamp perfectly, it gives you an excellent guide. And then you can just go back either with this or like with an even thinner one if you are really worried and use this Stila Stay All Day. So like here, I'll show you the difference between. So what I did was I ended up stamping it with this one. You see this is kind of, um, it's a little bigger. This one's super thin. So let me show you the difference. So, let's see, can you see it? It really is a dramatic difference because this one's so thin. Um, honestly, that's the only way that I used it, Jennifer, because um, I, didn't, I didn't buy the stuff that came with it, so I just painted on whatever onto the stamp. Like, like I would take the stamp and like just paint it right there and then stamp it, but that's exactly how I did this. And it didn't go on perfectly like this, but it gave me a guide to follow perfectly. So um, it's excellent for a guide. So I feel like, I mean, honestly, I, I never freehand my wings that big. And so it's nice for like a day when you're going out um, or you wanna just like, you know, really um, wear some, some pretty makeup or like glam it up or whatever, so. Anyway, well, that's it, you guys. How do you like the Wonder Brow? Here, let me see. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, and what I didn't show you guys, best advice I have for, the, for applying your eyebrows at all is make sure you wipe, like maybe with like a napkin or like a paper towel, just make sure you wipe your eyebrows before you even put them on. Because it, no matter what you're using, if there's oil or lotion or something under your eyebrow, this stuff's not going to stick. So I always, always wipe my eyebrows. Literally nothing. It's exactly what it was when I put it on. And I'm not like... I don't see my hair's moving around, but there's no wonder brow on my... <laughs> see... It's perfect you guys it looks great okay well I hope you loved it if you have any questions or comments let me know thanks for watching see you tomorrow bye